Hey guys, I'm Anthony and welcome to Life with Anthony. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Thanks for tuning in. I do appreciate your time. And to the rest of you, my YouTube family, how's it going on this Sunday? I hope you guys are doing very well and I'm just wondering what did you guys cook for dinner today because I cooked nothing. Nothing. Because I cooked this really good meal yesterday and I'm going to have it for lunch for the next couple of days. I'm not going to tell you what it is because I'm going to cook it for you guys. Coming soon. After I eat all that, it might be next week. Because <laughs> I cooked enough of it for the rest of this week, this upcoming week. But anywho, um, I wanted to come on today and talk uh, to you guys about something. So... The young lady at work, uh, she and I have formed or in the process of forming this really good work rapport. I call her my work friend now. And we, uh, we buy each other sodas and stuff like that. And even the operator has kind of jumped on the bandwagon and, you know, he's bringing us stuff as a crew in and everything. And... It's, it's a great rapport that the three of us are forming as a work team or work crew. But anyway, she um, was a little late for work today, uh, last night. We worked uh, Saturday for some overtime into this morning. And she was a little late. So about 20 minutes into the shift, I did like this to her. Like, you know, you're, you're, what you doing late, you know? And so uh, <laughs> later on in the shift, She's feeling comfortable with me now, and um, we, like I said, we, we're forming a little work uh, rapport. And so she uh, told me later on, well, I guess, I don't know where, but she was like, um, I have, she said, I'm tired. I said, oh, why didn't you get some sleep? She said, I have two jobs. And then uh, I said, okay. And then around, I guess about 20 minutes later, she came up to me and she showed me her phone where she had, uh, she worked for Amazon Flex. So, and she started telling me about, you know, how much money she makes at um, doing Amazon Flex and the hours she working and all kinds of uh, little details about the Am Amazon Flex type of job. And it got me to thinking for real. She told me, I kid you not, she told me she makes $700 a week delivering Amazon packages. And I was like, oh, really? Wow, okay. And seriously, it got me to thinking, okay, maybe I should be uh, doing something that's going <laughs> to enhance my financial life and, and get a second job or something like that. Because she works four hours from 3.30 to eight something like that and then she takes a nap and come to our job and I thought to myself wow that's a lot of money you know set to just deliver some packages and I was asking her all kinds of questions like you know are your deliveries in the same area and she said that you know the longest that they will send you is an hour away and I'm like an hour away for what what one package uh, anyway uh, she was just she just went on a little bit about telling me the details of the job and everything and she, you know she was like you should do you should do <laughs> and I was like I don't know you know and up until that point I never really thought about uh, another part time a part time job or anything I was just like you know I always feel like I'm so goddamn tired but at the same time I you know I spend so much time in this apartment I you know maybe it's time for me to make better use of my time and, 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 you know, and get another job or something, you know, it wouldn't hurt. It definitely would not hurt, you know, because <laughs> I, and I'm not going to sit here and say, you know, I can't use it because of course I can use it because that can help me get my car paid off sooner, you know, and to be quite honest, it might even give me a little more energy, you know. Because you know how you lay around all day? This is me. I can lay in bed all day calling myself getting rest for work the next, that 
upcoming night. And when it's time for me to go to work, I still feel as tired as I did when I first laid down. You, know, you guys ever do that? You lay down and then you wake up and you feel even more tired? <laughs> well, that seems to be the story of my life now. You very rarely on third shift get a really good sleep unless you are dead tired when you get off from work and you come right home and you lay right down. But, yeah, um, it got me to thinking that, you know, Maybe I should be making better use of my time rather than just laying down for eight or nine hours and still feeling tired afterwards. Maybe if I get up and do something that's, you know, going to earn me some additional money, I won't feel as tired. Sometimes you got to do things or become active to, to gain energy. And when you're not active, it's kind of like you're feeling sluggish and everything, you know. So I'm thinking about checking it out, you know, I'm thinking about checking it out. I'm thinking about asking her some questions about how she uh, signed up for it and everything because I could be making better use of my time than laying around doing nothing and still feeling tired. I can see if I'm laying around for eight or nine hours and I got all this energy ready to go to work tonight at night. No, that's not me at all, you know. So it's something that I'm definitely giving it a thought. Um, maybe uh, a part-time job would be good. I'm gonna tell y'all, the last time I worked two jobs, my full-time job and a part-time job, was probably 25 years ago, you know? And they never last because the one thing about a part-time job is you're quick to quit. If things don't go your way or you feel like you're not making enough money, or whatever the case may be, a part-time job, you're like, you'll quit in a heartbeat, though. Not like your full-time job where you got your benefits and everything. But I don't know. Uh, she works from 3.30 to 8, like I said. And I would much prefer to work kind of like closer to when I get off from work because I'm already up and then be done around like one o'clock in the afternoon and then I can come home and sleep you know but because I don't always go directly to sleep I'm, a, I'm not always sleepy when I get off from work at, uh, and uh, in the mornings so I can see me doing that job and some mornings I'm not quite ready to go to sleep and then it runs into the time when I have to almost get up and do the part-time job. Anyway, um, and that's not my, that wouldn't be my only uh, thing to look into as part-time. I, I would look into some other things as well, but this is just something that I'm thinking about that I only started thinking about it because she brought it to my attention and I just started thinking, you know, I sure can be using some additional money as well as better use of my time than you know, I spend way too much time in this apartment. <laughs> way too much time. I mean, I go out, take the trash out. <laughs> I might go for a walk around the complex every now and then. But yeah, I spend way too much time in this apartment and I can be better utilizing my time, especially if it's doing something that's going to bring me some additional income. And I'm gonna think about it. I am, I'm gonna give it some thought and I'm gonna talk to her a little more and see, you know, I'm going to look on here and see what other part-time jobs that uh, might be available in my immediate area. And the thing about a part-time job for me, I, I would have to have some requirements. I mean, I would one would only want to work like four days, four hours, four hours, four, four days a week, you know. I don't want to work every weekend, you know, one day week out of the weekend would be okay. If it's every, you know, like maybe every Saturday and I have Sunday off. But the, the Amazon Flex sound like a, a good fit, except the hours, the 3.30 to 8. Like I said, I'd rather go shortly after I get off and then I'll be done until I have to go back to work at 11.30 that night. But I think I can do it. I've always been the type of person that thought, oh no. I don't want to work no two jobs. 
<laughs> but I got all this free time on my hands <laughs> basically the entire day because it seemed like most of the world is working during the day except me, <laughs> you know. <laughs> but that's what I just wanted to sit down and run across you guys, you know. Maybe it's what I need. Maybe it will give me more energy or, you know, maybe if I just go my ass to the gym there lies the energy there at the gym but we know the gyms are not quite open yet but I think that they will be opening soon I also thought that I would quit or cancel my um, LA Fitness and rejoin Planet Fitness because Planet Fitness is literally one block after I come out of the complex up the street whereas I have to get in my car and drive to LA Fitness and you know if I switch gyms that might motivate me to, to actually work out here here we are in that like what going on the seventh month of the year I made a video in January a goals of improvement video which I talked about two things saving money and working out got the saving money thing going on but the whole workout thing whoo besides the few times I walked around the complex and recorded that's it I need to be working out I don't know what's the hold up with me working out even, even getting on the floor I, I, I thought about doing I, I, I thought about doing that uh, 100 push ups for 30 days I see that online now and I thought okay I thought about it hasn't happened yet so I don't know if the answer is to get another job or to actually work out so that I can start feeling more energetic or whatever. But I'm definitely going to give it some more thought. I'll keep you guys posted on if I decide to uh, take on a second job or whatever. I'm not a two job type of guy. I just don't like the idea of having to work two jobs. I just don't like that idea at all. Again, I tried this several times when I was younger, and none of those second jobs lasted a very long time, maybe a few months before I was like, okay, enough of that. But we'll see. And that's my little chat for today with you guys, just basically to check in with you guys as well and let you guys check in and see what's going on here with me. We did work overtime this Saturday. I got some overtime last Saturday, too. So this upcoming pay period, I'll have two overtime days. And I also want to buy something next year. And I know y'all going to be like, oh, Lord, Anthony. Lord, Anthony. Anthony, y'all going to be y'all gonna be like, Anthony, just stop. Just, 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 just stop right now. <laughs> I have been online looking at them. And, and by the way, I'm checking out Dawn's latest video. <laughs> but I have been online looking at him. This video, this video today is just random chats. I have been online and I'm going to show you guys what I have been looking at. And I don't know why. It's just like I can't get it out of my system. You know, I just, I can't. I can't get it out of my system. But I tried, I tried, but I just can't get it out of my system. Good gracious, can't get it out of my system, and I've been looking at them. I'm serious. Oh my God, do, you, do your eyes just randomly tear up? This is it. This is so. This is this is, this is, this is, this is so. This is so emotional for me. It is because I really, I just can't get it out of my system. I'm gonna show y'all. Y'all gonna be like, Andy, just, just please stop. <laughs> just stop. This is what I've been looking at. I have been looking at these. Oh my goodness. I have been looking at these conversion vans. See? I don't know if y'all can see it or not, but. And I've been looking at them on Facebook Marketplace. And let me tell you, I don't know where I've been because I've been out of the loop when it comes to Facebook Marketplace because they have a ton of 
conversion vans in this area and the immediate area like Philadelphia, even down in Maryland because I have Maryland in here as well as one of my search points. And they got them in all price ranges for $2,500 to $6,000. I want one of them. <laughs> Y'all probably, probably say You don't know what the hell. Y'all probably think Anthony, you don't know what the hell you want to do with your life. That's why it's life with Anthony now. But I mean, I think I want one just because, just for the sake of camping, even if I use it for like weekend camping trips or whatever, I just I just want one. I just, I really do. I'm going to get one next year. <laughs> Watch. My savings is going to be like, Boop. next thing you know, bam, I'm getting one. And I love Facebook Marketplace for this because, like I said, they have so many choices. Wow. And different price ranges. A lot of the ones are like 5000 and less. I'm getting I'm getting one next year, watch. <laughs> I'm getting me one. I'm saving money for a purpose, not for a rainy day, but for the buy one of these angle conversion vans. <laughs> that big old bulky one that I bought before, I had the green van. Oh my God, that thing was just too bulky. It looks big. I need like a smaller one that, you know, still a little high top, but looks smaller in size. But anywho, that's going to be it for today's little random chat here. I'm just like, I went from getting a part-time job to energy to watch it dawn to uh, getting a conversion van. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end it. Thanks for your time today. As always, thank you guys for taking a few minutes out of your day to watch my videos. I appreciate you guys, and thanks for listening to me ramble on today. And I'll see you guys the next time.